All right, team. So today's technique, we're going to do the triangle from the close guard using an overhook setup. All right. I really like this, this setup. We had a lot of success with this in competition. Um, and uh, Craig Jones uh, used this for a lot of his early career too. All right. It fits in nicely um, using the, the system of the Kimura and the armbar that we did before. Remember, both arms on the body was for the armbar, arms on the floor was for the Kimura, and the overhook triangle setup, we're gonna kind of have almost one of each, right? Um, one of each tends to mean like a triangle, but we'll include the setup we did earlier just so we have a, a common reference point because most people will start with hands on the body. So we're gonna go to that prayer position, right behind our partner's elbows. I pull upwards with my knees, and then I do a big swim with my hands. My left arm for this demonstration is gonna take the overhook, and my right arm is gonna establish the wrist control, all right? So you can see that at the moment, during, just during the demo, I'm flat on my back while I've established this. The problem with that is that when I'm flat on my back, Rose can free her arm by pulling her shoulder straight backwards. So she pulls straight back for posture, and I lose the overhook. So for today's set, when we establish that overhook, I want to get onto my side uh, and it kind of be at a right angle to my partner. So I come into that prayer position, I swim in, and notice that I get onto my side as I establish that overhook here and wrist control on the far side. Now she goes to sit up, she can't free the arm straight away. Right? She would have to pull it out by moving her body that way, but because I've got her locked onto me, she can't move far enough that way to make that work. All right? So that's a huge part of the success of this technique is getting onto your side here, okay? Maintaining that good wrist control, I'm gonna bring my, my top leg high on her body and my bottom leg is gonna come all the way out past her arm and I cut over her head to start my triangle. I can reposition here as need be and I lock the triangle in place, making sure that my calf cuts on the back of her neck and my free leg then cuts over my foot as much as I can, all right? For MMA, I want to actually maintain this wrist control through that whole duration because I don't want them punching me in the head, all right? But for Jiu-Jitsu at this point, you can actually relax with the arms and you can use them to readjust and tighten the triangle. I'm then going to migrate this arm to the opposite side of my body to finish because it's going to tighten up the space here on her neck, okay? So I do that by bridging forward, I pull her arm across and then I fold back in and I pull my knees in towards me. Some people get confused and think that the triangle is a pushing away or a knee squeezing inward option. Uh, really, I want you to think about it as a big hug, including your legs. So we're constricting forward and in in order to get the tap, all right? Let's go through that again. Okay. Prayer position. Swim, establish your overhook, your wrist control, and that side body position. I gotta feed my bottom leg through, and this just hold your posture a little bit. This might happen a few different ways. It could be that I have to get just the knee through first and then I pass the wrist around the foot. It might be that I'm flexible enough or short enough or whatever it's gonna to be to clear the leg out straight away. And then it comes up and bites in over the neck. Second leg locks it in place. Then I can release my overhook and readjust as need be, making sure that I never make any tight, tightening movements without this gate being closed. I don't want to get to here and have them pop out with posture. So I need to make sure that at all times, my hand, my leg, my hand, my leg, always one of them has got that gate closed. Okay, last piece, I need to migrate this arm across. So I bridge up, the arm across, settle in, square up, and then squeeze. Okay. So that was the <coughs> triangle from the close guard. Let's go one more angle. Prayer position. Oh, foot through, get to here, close, tighten, bridge, squeeze, <coughs> All right, man. overhook triangle from the close guard.